We would be honored if you would join us. Everyone's invited, of course. Hey Star Wars fans, welcome back to another video. This song got something a little bit different. Again, this one comes from Goody's Toys. He's, he's lent me this one just for the sole purpose of giving it a review. I'm really, really excited to take a look at this in hand. I haven't had a first-hand look at this, this piece yet. Uh, but it is Gentle Giant, uh, Premier Collection, 1 7th scale Ahsoka Tano statue. Now, I pre-ordered this myself and eventually I just sort of cancelled it just because at the time uh, it was getting pretty close to release and I just didn't have the funds. So I ended up cancelling my pre-order of this, but uh, just just seeing the images on the box firsthand, it's uh, it's tempting me to bite the bullet and, uh, and, and maybe jump in and go for it. So uh, now I know he hasn't opened this himself for a, for a proper look, so... He's given me the uh, he's given me the uh, opportunity to open this up firsthand. Um, interestingly, they've gone with the Star Wars Rebels logo, even though it's Clone Wars Ahsoka. So, I'm not sure what happened there. A little miscommunication between between the companies, but um, that's all right. A little more I. Um, but yeah, really, really excited to to open this one up. So let's do exactly that, and uh, I'll try and be super, super, duper careful. <laughs> All right, so here it is in the box. I'm going to be extremely careful to uh, to take this thing out. I uh, do have my trusty little exacto knife here in case there's any tape that needs to be cut. Um, there you see here, I've got the uh, certificate of authenticity, a two seven nine four of three thousand. So only three thousand produced. I'll just put that aside. You can see the number there as well, printed on there. Just slide that out. There's the receipt, I'll just tuck that back in there. I'm not sure what this is, but uh, okay, some of their other busts in the line. Premier Collection statues, half scale busts. Some other things they do. Just tuck that one aside. And yet there is some tape here, so I'm going to ever so carefully just uh, open this one up. I'm extremely, uh, extremely lucky to be the first one to open this up. Um, so yeah, I'm. I'm I'll do my best to be extremely cautious and careful. Little tab there. No, no, that should slide off nice and tidily. Put that on the floor. Okay, so. We have here the face. And this is a. Uh, this is really quite heavy. This is a really solid base. It's nice. A couple of peg holes there for the figure. Again, certified number underneath, limited edition two seven nine four. So I'll just set that to the side. We'll get more eye here. Nice and nice, nice and tidily packed. There's foam. There's silica pads. You know the little silica gel packs, just to stop any moisture. Even a tiny little piece of foam in there, just to sort of wedge that gap. So just ever so carefully. Look at that. That is stunning. So I'm just going to put that aside for the moment. And we'll get Lady Tano out of here. Oh boy, this is nice. All right, so I'm just going to set this up, and then I'll um, I'll set back and uh, do a just a close-up video around the statue itself. So. Absolutely stunning. Wow. 
Wow, look at that. That is just incredible. Yeah, I'm uh, certainly regretting my pre-order now. This thing is this thing is absolutely remarkable. All right, I'm going to uh, get the camera in my hand and we'll get close-up look. All right, this thing this is truly remarkable. Let's try and get a really nice look in close at this thing. Really great looking figure. More eye up there, the convoy, that looks absolutely beautiful. Love it, that is just incredibly detailed. Still through the wings there, that is, that is really nice, all the colors through the green. And look at the back of the wings. The tail, that's beautiful. Absolutely fantastic. Soka looks fantastic too. Really nice, really nice and heavy. So the armor on her arms there. The Montreals at the back, the main big one at the back. Looks good, nicely sculpted. Beautiful, nice and sleek. Lightsabers look good. Could have done with maybe a bit more of a uh, shinier chrome finish, but that's okay. A smaller Shoto blade there. Down to the bottom of her outfit. Just love those white lines throughout the outfit. It looks fantastic. That sort of symbolic of Mandalore. The armor plating on the uh, legs there, which is something that the Black Series figures missed severely. Same with the uh, the arm gauntlets there. Look at the back, this sort of armor plating on the back too. Looks really nice. Just the likeness looks pretty great too. I might just pop that arm off again. Just so we can get a nice close up look at her face without the... Uh... It looks pretty good. Nice. Sort of interpretation of the character. If you use your imagination, you could almost see a young Rosario Dawson here. That looks great. And really nicely painted. It's just like um, like a slight. I'm not sure if it. I don't think it's paint missing, but just on the bottom, the top of the bottom lip there. But I think that's to symbolise sort of light reflection. I think that looks really nice. This sort of semi-metal plating here looks good. The metal on the armor there looks fantastic, but I, uh, I personally can't get over this. This is just look at those eyes. That is absolutely stunning. The little claws sort of hanging onto the um, arm there. That is remarkable. I uh, <laughs> would be very very tempted. So I bite the bullet and grab one of these for myself because this is uh, absolutely fantastic. So yeah, I'd love to know what you think. Uh, drop a comment below. Let me know what you think about this statue. Um, again, big thanks to uh, Andy at Goodies Toys for for lending me this one for review. I'm uh, absolutely blown away. I can't thank him enough for allowing me to. To be the first one to open this and uh, get my hands on it, and I'm going to be uh, extremely careful to pack this thing away exactly how it came, so um, he can experience opening it as well. Boy, oh boy, that's uh, that's brilliant. Now, if I just grab a black series figure really quick, just to uh, compare the size and scales. Go. Yeah, let me know in the comments below. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you've yet to subscribe to my channel, please do hit the notification bell and you can get all the videos straight away. 
as soon as they drop. Thank you very, very much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Look forward to seeing you on the next video. Until then, may the force be with you always. We're a little rushed, so if you'll just get on board, we'll get out of here.